What's going on guys, this is your host Fudman02 and today I'm going to be talking to you a little bit about rage quitting. Now from the people that have played with me before on PC or the Xbox, Battlefield Bad Company 2 or Left 4 Dead 2, I am filled with fucking rage. And there's good reason for that. I don't know if this uh, almighty creator of the universe, uh, if there actually is a god, If I think he fucking hates me. I go and play on PC and I got shit connection to the point where I can't even play. I go to play 360. And this sort of shit that you're about to see unfolds. Now right here, I just wanted to show you how much fun I was having, because I managed to get behind the enemy spawn. Uh, our teammates armed the objective, and I sat back here with my pistol, and just waited for them to go and disarm it. And uh, looking back, I could have pulled out the Neostead and just unloaded it in that way, but I am not the most skilled shotgun user in the game. I think the highest amount of kills I have with any of my shotguns is on the 870, and it's only about 200 kills. I'm not a big fan of shotguns. But back to what I was saying. It's having a lot of fun here, you know, struggling a little bit, uh, trying to learn how to use the shotguns, and uh, trying to throw down that rage. So I'm going in here after I cleared out those th uh, three people, got a couple assists, I'm going to arm it and toss a nice little surprise on there to hopefully rip open the sphincter of any uh, unsuspecting victim, rip it open much like that of an extremely homosexual man whose sphincter is stretched to the point where they have to uh, stick a cork in their own anus just to make sure that the diarrhea doesn't doesn't pour out that sort of ripping that's the sort of stuff I'm looking for and uh, I do die here I wasn't angry about that at all but it's the sh kind of shit that you're about to see coming up right about here that just makes me never want to fucking play video games again I don't understand how this sort of shit happens because on Xbox dedicated servers they're always pretty goddamn good servers I don't understand what the fuck this is so watch this this might blow open your mind one two three Okay, he went behind the tree. One, right in the fucking face, and a knife. What the fuck? And that's why I don't enjoy playing Battlefield anymore. I don't know what the fuck's going on with this game. This is Fudmo2 here. Peace. Alright guys, my mistake. Uh, I was going to cut the video there, but I just got this uh, pretty nice game, so I figured, you know what, instead of a two minute video, I'll put this in here. And uh, instead of uh, just telling you guys, you know, everybody sucks but me at flying helicopters, and instead of saying, uh, instead of uh, enforcing my dominance amongst the virtual, uh, not real helicopter pilots with, within video games, I won't do that. Oh shit, drop my pop can. I won't do that, but uh, I decided to know. You give some tips here because there's nothing more infuriating for me when some scrub hops in the helicopter and has no idea what he's doing and ends up crashing it. So that's what you're gonna want to do. You get it, it, when you get logged on to, by a missile, use the map to your advantage. I like to hide behind these uh, this railing here, going just behind the uh, those big gas canisters. There is a great place. The rocket will usually hit there. And just for added security, you can actually hide behind this little, uh, um, what do you want to call that, a dock? So there you guys go, a quick little pro tip, don't know if you already knew that, but uh, yet again, I'm better than you.